You're with Hello. us now. Welcome, Shinobu. Welcome, baby. Hi, guys. So, welcome back to our channel. So, we're going to feed Shinobu a small beef, a small beef ribs. Ta da! We got it from Mozu. It's only uh, this. Uh, this was a five ninety nine, I think. Let me let me let me take a shot of the beef one, please. Yes. Can you turn it around? There you go. We're going to feed her this today, so I'm going to cut it with scissors. What We're outside. It? It's because uh, we don't want to. We don't want like raw meat inside the house because she will be like going everywhere the house with this bone so we're actually mm. in the backyard mm -hmm. so i'm going to cut it now Shinobu, baby. Come. is it is it her first time eating some this is actually her first time eating a raw bone mm. we give her like the smoke one if you guys seen in our previous uh videos you will see that she ate a smoke bone before so let her lick this come on lick it you're good smelling girl. it. Good girl, baby. Good girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She seems interested in yeah, the Yeah, look at that. Look at that. She's licking it. <laughs> A good dog. Oh, wow. I didn't know. Like, I thought she would be peekier than that. Well, I didn't give her nothing to eat. So <laughs> <laughs> this is like her You meal. made sure she was hungry for the bone. And... Okay. If we're just like yeah you can hold the bone with one of your hands yeah i think i can just hold it so we just got off from um yeah, we just good. came from a dog park today at centennial maybe i can just do that eh like this yeah you can just hold it like this you just hold it yeah, you don't need to talk you hear that just go like Oh my gosh, just a mosquito. I think I'm gonna get closer so we can hear her eat. Yeah. Hold on guys, the camera's gonna move a little bit. Sorry guys, I'm not a pro cameraman, but <laughs> I'm trying to get a close shot for you guys. So she's actually enjoying it. Her first time eating some raw meat. I think we tried before, huh? That wasn't a raw meat. That was like a, a raw what was beef, it? Uh, burger beef or something like that. Mm -hmm. Not like this, not a rib one. Mm -hmm. That's like a rib bone. And she's enjoying it. Like, because I think a mosquito crazy. just bit me. Yep. I'm holding it because... I don't want, oh man, I think I got bitten by a mosquito. Yeah. Stop complaining. I'm gonna zoom a lot. Yeah. Oh my god. She like that fat. Can you like? Turn it around. Yeah. Oh, wow. And now I understand why people use gimbal to film videos. Because it's not moving. No, because it's, it's heavy on the hand. It's all the camera. Okay, I'll let it down in the floor. Yeah, you can let it. Stay. Can you go? Stay. You didn't hear the cat? Like, there's a cat around. That's why she's mad. Can you go stay? To get a closer shot. Mosquito here. Let me kill the mosquito. The mosquito here. Oh, Stop here. making noise. Let her eat. Let me wash my hands. Yes.
Yeah, the, the rib bone, we left it in a cage, uh, not in a cage, I'm sorry if I guess. We left it in a freezer for the last two days. And then today, around eight in the morning, like 12 hours 12 hour ago, we took it away and we put it in the sink. She's hearing some noise. And then after we put it out from the sink, now 12 hours later, Around the eight at night, she's eating it. I'm really surprised that she's eating it like with no stress. I thought she would be peaky because she's kind of peaky eater, but she likes it. She likes raw meat, like every other dog would eat raw meat. I think she's into it. That's a good bird dog. Does she know about my Lenoir? They're loyal dogs. They're really intelligent. And they do nice protection. However, they're a small dog. They're not big dogs. So a lot of people think only one are big, but they're small. Um, what I mean by small, I mean by for a protection dog is really, really small. And that's the reason why it's a top choice in the military because they want to be able to carry the dog sometime in their bag. So I was saying that the military, they love to use that dog because it's small and light. Not because it's big and ferocious. Because it's small, it's light, uh, and it's really like easily trainable. You can make it do whatever you want, whatever treats you, you want them to do. A lot of people tell us, oh no, this is not a good pet. This dog is not a pet, it's a working dog. Look, I'm going to tell you something. It depends on what type of owner you are. If you're a good owner, you know how to handle your dog, you know how to take care of your dog, you know how to make your dog run, you know how to use like use up all the energy by making them do mind work and body work, you can get any dog as a pet. It doesn't matter what kind of dog it is. She's going be right here right now. She's a pet. She's nice around kids. You can pull her ears, you can pull her tail. She won't never fight. She's not around. She's nice around kids. She follows her rules when we call her. Um, we, we go out with her like to the dog park at least one to two hours a day to the dog park and we put her on a treadmill at least one hour a day so she has every day two hours of exercise that's how much exercise she's get two hours per day Self because those kind of dogs they shed a lot. I know they don't look like they have a lot of hair, but that's a double coat right there, and they shed a lot. Right now, she doesn't have her double coat because uh, the winter is finished in summer right now, but she, she's still shedding, so we de shed her like once a month, but we should do it at least like once a week but we do it only once a month and we give her back once a month too we cut her nails once a month and yeah The video quality is really good. Oh wow. And I'm surprised on how much she's eating. Like she's eating a lot of it. Yep. I thought she would be picky. I was telling the viewers that Shinobu's a picky dog. She is, <laughs> like you. <laughs> like him. I'm not picky. Yes, you are picky before. And then she got it from me though. Yeah.
I'm, I'm not gonna lie to you, holding the camera for that long hurts. I told you, you want me to get the stand? No, the stand is way too tall. We need a smaller stand, remember? No, but it's pretty genre come descend. Yeah. You know? yeah. I'm trying, I'm gonna try you to get switch? closer. Let's go no, it's fine, switch. it's fine, don't worry. I'm gonna try to get closer so that we Oh, look, she's lying down. I'm gonna put the camera down, see what it does. I'm not gonna lie to you, the video won't be that good because oh holding a camera is not an easy job. I'm not Are gonna you lie to you. Much? It's heavy. You wanna you wanna try it? No, thank you. <laughs> I told you we can get the stand. Hold up. Let me get another shot. Oh wow. We have to wash her paw later. No. Look at all that. We have to wash everything. Everything is like right now she's lying down on it. So we have to wash like yeah. her paw and her her body. Yep. Oh, by the way, Shinobu is 10 months old. And yep, she's 10 months old. Usually old. when we give her those bones, we give it to her smoked. And she, she chews, she swallows all of it. Is her poop going to be... Uh, soft? Yeah. Yeah, it's going to be soft. But you, you know what? I, I'm not, I don't have a lot of knowledge. I remember I heard that from a YouTuber because you know, I watch a lot of YouTube videos and that's where I learned a lot of the teaching on dogs. That's why I got a lot of my tricks and I use YouTube to raise my dogs. Shout out to uh, Cabral. I'm not sure what this guy name is. I think it's Cabral. <laughs> Shout out to Documentary and shout out to uh, Master Paul. All right, Charlize, I think we're gonna switch. You're gonna hold the camera. Yeah. Yo, guys, look, guys, look at me. I'm not a small guy. I am not a small guy. But damn, the camera is heavy. Like when you hold it like this. And look guys, your dog should never show aggression when they're eating. Since Shinobu was small, I was playing with her like this. I was pulling her tail. I was playing with her, taking her ears, doing whatever. She would never, never, never fight back. I could put my hands close to her food. I could take it away from her. She won't hurt me. It's a, it's a really important to teach your dog as a young age that food aggression is not tolerated in the house. Especially if you have kids around in the home, you don't want your dog to have food aggression. That's not good at all. Yo, there's there's a lot of meat on that one, huh? Yep. You see that? Yes.
I'm gonna film with my iPhone. Okay guys, we'll keep you updated. As soon as you finish, we'll show you what's the result. Okay guys, I think that's it for today's Shinobu. You're gonna finish that some other day because it's getting late and we have to wash you. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and click the notification button for more video. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Ciao!